Hi, I'm Megan from Newbie and Me, and today I'm going to talk to you about the differences between the original Joy Spin 360 and the improved Joy iSpin 360. So the main thing that is different about these two is that their testing is different. The Joy Spin 360 has been tested to what we call R44. That's our current guideline in the UK, and that's for front, rear, and rollover testing. The Joy iSpin has been tested to slightly higher speeds for both front and rear, as well as side and rollover testing as well. In terms of features, they're very similar, but this one is slightly easier to use. For instance, the rotating is just to the side on this one, and you have it on each side, as opposed to the Joy Spin 360, the rotation button is underneath. So when you're rearward facing, it's a much easier car seat to move around with the eye spin than it is the Spin 360. Both of these car seats go from birth to 18 kilos, which is around four years. Now with the Joy Eye Spin, it has to be rearward facing for a minimum of 15 months, but you can keep it rearward facing for the whole 18 kilos, four years. Whereas with the Joy Spin 360, you can move to forward face from nine kilos, or again, remain rearward facing for the whole 18 kilos. Another feature of the eye spin, just to be cautious of that 15 month rule, is that if you pop it onto 0 to 15 months and you're using it rearward facing, it will not allow you to pop the car seat in the forward facing position in the car. And this is just a safety element to make sure that baby is safe for as long as they have to be rearward facing. Both of these car seats, have the newborn inserts, which we'll just remove as your little one gets older. And you'll just pull those straps through, remove the inserts, and just behind the headrest, you'll lift that up as your little one gets older. They also have these toggles to the side, which will hold your clips out of the way. What this will also do is keep the clips cool in the summer, so the metal doesn't get too hot from the sun. The Joy Eye Spin 360 does have the extra side impact protection. So when you strap baby in, these will automatically pop out to fill the gap between the car seat and the door. Both are fitted with Isofix and they do have green indicators either side of the Isofix points. On the Eye Spin, it's nice and easy to see that your leg is in the fixed position does light up green at the top of the Isofix leg. On the Spin 360, it is further down at the bottom of the leg. So again, just a little bit more difficult to see, but still there. Now, the Joy Spin 360 retails at £220 as opposed to the Joy iSpin, which retails at £320. Now, for a full demonstration on both of these car seats or to try them in your car, just pop into one of our stores 